Boy, you nailed this down on page five, paragraph three. You put this in quotes. Words matter. You wrote down the words so we can all have the words in front of us now. There's 28 words there that are in quotes, and it says, quote, I hope, this is the president speaking, I hope you can see your way clear to letting this go, to letting Flynn go. He is a good guy. I hope you can let this go. Now, those are his exact words. Is that correct? Correct. And you wrote them here, and you put them in quotes? Correct. Okay. Um, thank you for that. He did not direct you to let it go. Not in his words, no. He did not order you. <laughs> not in his words. <laughs> Again, those words are not in order. No. He said, I hope. Now, like me, you probably did hundreds of cases, maybe thousands of cases, charging people with criminal offenses. And of course, you have knowledge of the thousands of cases out there that uh, where people have been charged. Do you know of any case where a person has been charged for obstruction of justice, or for that matter, any other criminal offense, where this they said or thought they hoped for an outcome? I don't know well enough to answer. And the reason I keep saying his words is, I took it as a direction. I mean, as the President of the United States, with me alone saying, I hope this, I took it as, this is what he wants me to do. Now, I didn't, I didn't obey that, but that's the way I took it. You may have taken it as a direction, but that's not what he said. Correct. I, that's he, what said, I said. he said, I hope. Those are exact words, okay. correct. You, you don't know of anyone that's ever been charged for hoping something. Is that a fair statement? I don't as I sit here. Yeah, thank you. Thank you, Mr. Chairman.